outlining all the cases to be heard tonight. Uh, we have we have an alteration, if you will, or deviation from uh, the line that shows there and how they go. We're actually going to start this evening. Jason, if you're prepared to give your case on case number REZ 2016-22 Exit 13 Development. Yes, sir, I am. Um, this particular item, number six on the agenda that is listed, is a request to rezone about 24 acres from highway commercial with conditions to M2. With that, staff has looked at the request. You have the recommendations in front of you. I would point out the condition that was recommended from planning to try to trim the uses down to allow for the distribution center without allowing for some of the other M2 uses that we think will be problematic for the area. Uh, the applicant's representative has said that condition uh, works for them. They agree with it. I do expect them to speak in a few minutes in case you have questions for them. Other than that, I don't have any updates for you. And the slides we have are just the zoning, the aerial, and the future development map for the subject property. So with that, we'll try to entertain any questions that you may have, but that is my presentation for this one. Commissioners, I know each one of you had a chance to look over this. Do we have any questions for staff? at this time on this request. I did understand you say that they were in agreement with the recommendations. <clears throat> yes, sir. There was only one condition from planning about the uses, and I did hear from the applicant today they were okay with that condition. Very good, thank you. Okay. Any other questions, commissioners? There being none, this time I will take any interested party wishing to speak in favor of this request to come forward at this time. <coughs> State your name, your address, for the record, please, sir. Clayton Milligan, uh, representing the client of Lovell Engineering at 3998 Inter Predator Road, Northampton, Georgia. Uh, really, the only reason we're having to request is resulting in the size of the building. The use of the queer 130,000 square feet would actually qualify for the existing highway commercial, but because we're a 100,000 square foot building, that requires us to, to rezone and the only zone which would allow building that size. Is the so we're fine restricting it to the use that we're requesting because that's the only reason that we're requesting this to be done so we can build a, a larger building. Okay. Thank you, Blake. We have to answer any other questions, anybody? Commission, any questions for presenter? Uh, if I may, I'm in the and work session says one here, but what is the uh, what are you building? What's, what kind of uses? Do you it's a uh, hundred thousand square foot distribution warehouse that handles small packages, twenty yeah. hours a day, seven days a week. But I'm not sure what you say. Time on that, Clayton. They're wanting to move pretty quick, assuming they, they're going to make a no-go, a go-no-go no -go decision here sometime in December. So, I mean, we could be, I've already, we could be starting construction in January, February. This, this, this is outside the realm of employment opportunities? I believe, I've heard somewhere in the neighborhood 150. We base that on the number of parking spaces. Right. And so they have, I mean, I thought it was closer to 200 yes. parking spaces, Clayton. Yes. The parking lot, I think we're at, we're over 200 spaces on the parking lot. Commissioner, any questions for the presenter? All right. Clayton, thank you very much. Anyone else here wishing to speak in favor of this request? <coughs> there being none, anyone here wishing to speak against this request? Anyone else here speaking? Again, please come forward. There being none, commissioners, any discussion amongst ourselves on this? I, I may want to ask another question to staff if I can. Yes, sir, please do. Would there be a reason that we need to limit the usage of this because we're going to M2 to the actual usage that's there? Yes, sir. Our concern was the amount of intense uses they can go to M2 that might not be the best fit for this property. So that was our aim, was to try to give them their proposed use with some flexibility. But that was our that was our aim, sir. We believe it's necessary. But with, the, with a condition yes, sir. to limit it to small packaging? I think we just tried to keep it to a distribution facility. Distribution, okay. So that way we could give them, you know, some umbrella to operate under without opening M2 wide open. Okay. Since there's no further discussion at this time, I will take a motion on this request, Commissioners. Mr. Chairman. Commissioner Wiles. I'd like to make a motion that we uh, approve this request for changing this 24.8 acre track from highway commercial to heavy manufacturing with the restriction on the uh, M2 uses as described by 
staff and accepted by the applicant. Okay, we have a motion from Commissioner Wiles. Do we have a second? I'll second. We've got a second from Commissioner Willis before we vote. Is there any more discussion amongst ourselves? There being none, all in favor, please say probably raising your right hand. Ms. Carmelo has 8-0. Thank you, Commissioners.